Welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I last uploaded a player review video and I'm coming back with a bang. It's Future Stars. I've gone out and brought this Lauren James card. Cost me just under 1.6 million for it. I'm hoping that she'll come down in value, but she might rise up in value as well. This is the mystery of the market these days. But let's look at this card and see what I make of it and see if she's worth the price tag that she has on the card. So she's high low work rate, five star, four star, a very nice start to an attacking card. Got a nice selection of positions, striker cam, centre forward, right wing on the card as well. So when you're building that team, you've got that flexibility of putting her in different positions. Now, the biggest thing that has changed since I last did a player review is that players now have two playstyle pluses, or some of the pro mode players have two playstyle pluses, and she is one of them. She's got the rapid plus playstyle, which I'm a big fan of. I quite like that. Then she has flair plus as the other one. Now, it might be nice if this was maybe technical plus or maybe a finesse plus or something like that instead. But beyond that, I'd say she's got a nice collection of play styles on the card. Then moving into the stats of the card. She's got nice pace, shooting, passing. Dribbling's pretty good, although the agility and balance, some could argue, is a bit low for themselves. But I've used a lot of other cards with similar balance and agility, and I quite like them in-game. As for chem style, I've gone with a hawk just to give the pace a little bit more of a boost, the shooting. I was tempted maybe to go with a maybe a hunter or something like that just to really maximize the pace. But she's got 95 acceleration. So with the hawk, she's got max acceleration now and just helping that sprint speed. So by putting a hunter on her, I feel like that is a little bit wasted as a chem style. But let's have a look at the team that she's in. And it's a very nice looking team for those that haven't seen my team. So actually I need to change the Saliba actually because I've got his latest version. But this is what my team is going to be. We're going to go into some Div Rivals. Try out Lauren James. See how good she's going to be. Uh, striker alongside Mia Ham in the 4 triple two formation. Alright here we go. Look, come on Lauren James. Nice rapid. Get that distance away and what? The hell was that shot? Like, I'm expecting a player of your caliber, Lauren James, to be putting that into the back of the net. Go on then. Lauren James, what are we doing? Get. <sighs> Tried to get past uh, Van Dyke there, but we didn't quite get the shot off cleanly. Come on. Come on. Nice. <sighs> nice bit of skill there from Lauren James, but. Oh, well, we get a corner out of it. Right, come on then. Don't let Virgil stop you. Ah, you called out your goalkeeper. You didn't approach me with Van Dyke like I was probably expecting. And we get the first goal of James. Go on. Yes, rapid to help get past that first man. Nice pass. An assist for Lauren James to Ham. Like, I do like using that uh, rapid play style in some ways to help, like, just help get past the defender. Especially if it's not a man mounting, like, Virgil van Dijk or something. Straight cross. Comfortable. Easy. That's just a comfortable, like, sweat across. And just all I have to do is shoot and get into the back of the net. There we go. Use the pace. Lovely. Behind the fence. Oh. I thought for a second she was going to comfortably get behind the defense and uh, maybe create a one on one situation, but she didn't. Nice. There we go. Straight into the back of the net for a hat trick. Got to love sh simple, straightforward passes and getting in behind. Oh, come on. Yeah, use that rapid again. Oh my gosh. That is another shot in this game that I would have expected her to put into the back of the net that she's now missed. See, again, there you go. Like that little push to. Oh no. Oh, that little push 
to give you that massive open space to run into is always great with that playstyle plus pass and another cheap ass goal for me to be scoring but hey goals are goals at the end of the day conceded another goal but it's another opportunity from a kickoff to do something Uh, if maybe I had someone taller than Ham, Ham might have got the pass. Oh, 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 go for the assist instead. Mm, could you argue that was a BS goal? Van der Sar was right there, but that's another assist for Lauren James. That's her involved in every single one of the goals so far. Well, there's something that I can definitely say is she's perfectly able to score those goals when she's in front of goal most of the time. Because obviously, as you've seen, she has missed a couple of shots. But five goals, two assists in a rage quit win. I'll happily take that from the card. There we go. The confirmed stats in the end. Five goals, two assists. Final thoughts and feelings on the card. I... In some ways, we'll say she is definitely worth the value of the card. She's definitely up there with how good she's feeling in-game. And the similar comparison would be Ham. And I love Ham. I love that card. And I've got to say this, Lawrence James is feeling very similar to that card in-game in the way it performs and feels on the ball, passing, dribbling and stuff like that. But feeling probably a li slightly little bit faster than the ham card thanks to that play style plus and i generally think she's not going to be that hard to fit into a team especially nowadays since uh people have a lot of icons in their team she's english so it's not going to be hard to get a nation link club link as well there's a lot of chelsea special cards on the women's and the men's side of the game but if you manage to pack lauren james or you try her out let me know what you think of the card in the comments section but that is it for this player review. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye-bye, guys.